Good evening, my friends. You got Shempy here, bringing you another Road to Glory video. With Shane Falco, this one against Stanford. They're running the pro style against the spread, and uh, you know, usually they have a lot of excess against these type of teams that you know have some big bruisers with a spread. But early on here, having a lot of trouble. Had a wide open running lane. Thought I could find my man downfield, but. Just don't have the arm strength yet. And, uh, you know, early on here, well, Michael James does not play well. I find him open here. He uh, gets the first down, but, you know, on those runs early on, he's not breaking any tackles. They're making this pretty hard for me. And uh, they got a 7-0 lead, and we'll maintain that lead for quite a while because I'm struggling, but, you know, we got to have Michael James breaking tackles. You know, you don't want a freshman quarterback running your entire team, and I wanted to get this guy involved, but he just wasn't doing it. But we'll continue on here. They're running a couple corners on a blitz, and I finally on Michael James. I thought he had a pretty easy first down, but broke one tackle and gets hit out of bounds. But, uh, you know, he can't be completely at fault. The offensive line isn't doing their job, especially on that right side. A little bit weak, but... Uh, you know, I thought I had a wide open man here, but unfortunately I don't throw it in a good area and uh, someone covering another man was able to come across and get there. But, you know, on a comeback route, that's why receiver number 80 continuing to have an impact and being you know, one of my favorite targets. But I gotta, gotta run it here a little bit and get a nice nine yard gain on first down. But uh, one of my favorite plays is running streaks because even if you don't find someone open you know you got everyone back in coverage and a lot of running room and making some plays here spin moves jukes moves and looking amazing here but uh you know i gotta find little michael james on the outside and unfortunately you can't break that first tackle from that star linebacker and he ends up making a lot of these tackles and maybe that's why we can't break any tackles, but I'm finding that sweet possession receiver. He makes a great catch in the end zone. We're finally on the board at the end of the first half. But, uh, you know, trying to get started here, Michael James continuing to not break tackles. But I uh, find my man here on a crossing route. And uh, those tend to be really great plays. They take a little while to develop sometimes. But if you got the patience, you'll be rewarded and on the run here, you'll see a lot of the receivers get open late. And my tight end finds a seam and takes it downfield and continuing to roll over this Stanford defense after struggling a little bit in the first. But unfortunately, I saw a guy wide open. When you run too far away, the icons disappear. So I didn't know what he was. It was actually X, my tight end, and he was wide open, but I ended up dishing it off to the uh, halfback and here finding that possession receiver who makes a great run after the catch hangs onto the ball and lowers the shoulder and you know we're pretty close to the end zone here and was gonna run it in but I find the guy you know wide open he splits the defense and absolutely making great plays but going back to these crossing routes you know patient with it offensive line holds their blocks and uh, it gets open late and finding some outside receivers here and once again another crossing route he gets tripped up a little bit at the beginning the linebacker just can't keep up with him after that and uh, you know one of the beauties about doing those middle crossing routes and uh, you know, I got in a little bit of trouble here but I was able to move around split the defense a little bit and just barely get the first down and you know, abusing the middle and unfortunately he didn't cut it up field because that could have been a touchdown with his speed you know, number 80 being one of my faster receivers, but something you love to see, you know. If you got someone in man defense running that uh, slant route, it proves to be one of the best routes in the game. Because if you just get a step on him, which is pretty easy, you can get a touchdown. But here, you know, number 80 running the sweet route, faking a cut inside, and uh, got a seven point lead, but I'm not satisfied. And neither is LaMichael James. He's continuing to do. A little bit of work and, uh, you know, still not breaking anything too huge, but, uh, you know, the wide receiver coming up big across the middle and it's where you like to find those possession guys. 
But here, I'm in some trouble. They got some decent coverage, and <laughs> number 23 sneaks out. Find him, but unfortunately, LaMichael James continuing to hurt my team, and he gets a hold, and here's a play that it took me a little while to learn when exactly to throw this ball. It's the wide receiver screen. He cuts right across. All the linemen block up field, and you want to throw it pretty quick, actually. I thought you had to hold on to it, because uh, that's how I always ran it in high school. But actually, you want to get rid of it pretty quick. As long as it's not man coverage, it's usually pretty good. But here, I get drilled as I throw it. He catches it downfield. Awesome catch. And uh, unfortunately, I try to throw it to my man on the cut. He's trailing behind a little bit. Something I wasn't expecting. I lay him out after throwing the interception. <laughs> not too bad. If you throw an interception, that's how you want to finish it. But, uh, you know, they score. And there's 20 seconds left. We might just have a drive here. Finding a man way downfield, number 80, using that speed, breaking some tackles, and finding little Michael James, getting the ball to the center of the field, and, you know, getting the first down here, which stops the clock, but, you know, we just wanted to come up with a field goal, and there it is. We get the win. All three touchdowns coming off of passes for me. You know, I don't like to scramble too much in this game, just because I feel cheap when I do it sometimes. I like to scramble around in the backfield, you know, find my men downfield. And, uh, you know, that works pretty well with this Oregon offense. With, uh, you know, as a five-star recruit, they way overrated me. And my ratings are kind of ridiculous for a freshman, especially in the running game. And that's why I like to pass it quite a bit. But uh, we'll take a look at the stats here. 322 yards. Very solid game for a freshman uh, quarterback. And terrible game for LaMichael James. And... Got to get him started for the rest of the year and check out the receivers. The number 80, whose name I'm not even going to try to pronounce. <laughs> That's another great game. And uh, see ya!